Hey, Wealth Builders, Aaron Renfrew here. And uh, did you know that the system's rigged? Not a conspiracy theory. The system is set up to take wealth from you and redeposit it to the banks. There's a banking cartel at work in America, and this isn't a conspiracy theory. If you want it to be, it could be. But if you look at the mechanics of it, it's pretty clear. So check this out. All right, most of us go to work for a job to create money. That's not the conspiracy. Where the conspiracy comes in is after that. You get your money, and a lot of people put their money directly into the bank. Auto deposit, boom, that's the bank's goal. Why? Fractional reserve lending, they can lend it out at 10 times your deposit. But a lot of people, if we block this down here, think, oh, I don't have my money go directly to the bank. But if you work your job to do a car payment, a personal mortgage, a boat, schooling, credit cards, retirement, all that money is getting channeled back to the bank. So, did you look at it before the way it's laid out that everything is getting channeled to the bank? Then the bank, with fractional reserve lending, takes every dollar and lends out $10 back to us and amplifies the cycle and continues it on. Now, I use banks and banks are a good tool. But the way the system is generated is all these minions and all these people are out working their tails off to pay interest to the bank, to build the banks up and make them wealthy. So the question is, if you don't want to make the banks wealthy, or you're okay with them having their fair share, but you want to get wealthy, what's the secret? Okay, so the whole secret is flow. The job, directly to the bank, or through car payment and all these items we mentioned, the flow goes this way. Instead, what happens if you channel the flow down this way and you go directly into investment real estate, businesses, royalties, direct into the stock market outside of the institutions, which are, by the way, owned by most of the banking system. It comes back to them. Uh, invest in mentors and education, or you yourself be the bank. Start lending it out. Cut out the bank from making major profits and direct it to yourself. Now, this is going to take a huge investment in, the way, in changing the way you think. Why rich people are always talking about mindset and they're always talking about education. So in order to change the flow from the bank and flow it to you, you've got to skip everything being automatically channeled to the bank. You need things that put money in your pocket so that you can reinvest and do the trick of the bank. Now they have a monopoly on fractional reserve lending, but you can still leverage your returns and still grow your wealth. The trick is knowing what part of the system you're in. Are you outside the system or are you in the system and being used